All right, so we're here with Smudge and Tear Top today, and we are going to do a little video on different types of reinforcers. Yes, they are both working on not jumping up, and we are presented with new people, and especially in the home, sit. Yes, so I'm using a treat as a reinforcer, so food is reinforcer right now, these small Zooks treats. Um, I tend to cut these up pretty small and use them, but the Zooks are nice because they're already fairly little. Yes. So we have to ask our learner what type of reinforcement they want in the moment. Um, these guys have been through a couple training sessions already today. So the main motivator initially before the training session, the reward would have been attention and tactile, which is petting. Um, but you're kind of working on treats now because they've calmed down about the initial greeting and the initial excitement of being touched. So I'll give you an example of tactile or touch as a reward. Yes, good girl. So I'm just gonna pat her what she likes a lot. Now, some dogs don't like tactile reinforcement. Maybe we're working with a fearful dog and they don't want to be touched. Um, that's a whole other topic, but just to kind of talk about different things you can do. Another reinforcer that we can use is a toy. So if we ask her to touch, yes, good boy. What's this? What is this? And he's not as excited about it, but Smudge would work for that toy under the right circumstances. So we've got different reinforcers, food, tactile, toys, um, different treats and that kind of thing can also be good reinforcers. So. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you soon.